China Airlines Flight 140 On April 26, 1994, China Airlines Flight 140, an Airbus A300-600R, was making its final approach to Nagoya Airport, Japan. It was a late night flight from Taipei. All seemed routine. At just three minutes from landing, the pilots accidentally triggered the go-around mode, a setting that tells the plane to climb again instead of land. But they didn't realize it had activated. The autopilot took over and began pitching the nose up. The pilots fought back manually, but their actions conflicted with the autopilot, which kept pushing the plane higher. As the struggle continued, the aircraft stalled mid-air, and then it nosedived. 264 people died in a fiery crash just short of the runway. Only seven survived. This tragedy exposed a critical flaw in Airbus's flight control logic. Once go-around mode was activated, the pilots couldn't fully override it manually, a quirk that Airbus had not clearly warned about. Worse, the crew was never trained for this scenario. After the crash, Airbus redesigned the A300's go-around system. They also rewrote manuals, updated training, and made flight control behavior more transparent for pilots. Flight 140 was a wake-up call. Even in modern planes, automation needs to be human-proof and human-friendly.